NRG Stadium, formerly Reliance Stadium, is the home of the NFL's Houston Texans. The initial plans for the stadium started in 1997 when Houston NFL Holdings, the group that represented the NFL expansion team for Houston, reached out to HOK Sport to begin design work for the NFL's first retractable roof stadium. The stadium's goal was to have the intimate feeling that mimicked the Astrodome, but also allowing for the roof to be open on pleasant Houston fall and winter days. Groundbreaking for the stadium began on March 9, 2000, on a site neighboring to the Astrodome. The structure was topped off later in October of 2001, with the official opening coming in 2002, when on August 24th, the new Houston Texans lost their first ever preseason game to the Miami Dolphins. Capacity for the stadium sat at a respectable 69,500, putting it on pace with other NFL stadiums. The playing surface for the stadium was equally as innovative as its retractable roof. The Texans used a system of trays of sod on which natural grass could grow. The concept was abandoned in 2015 when the Texans installed artificial turf to be used on high school and later Texans games. The design for the stadium itself was revolutionary for the time. Unlike the domed and fabric roof structures of the past that often felt dark and cramped, Reliant Stadium would have large windows to create an extremely open feeling. The fabric roof, as previously mentioned, was the first retractable roof system in the NFL. The seam of the roof meets at the 50-yard line, and the roof can be open from end zone to end zone in only 7 minutes time, with the panels traveling at a speed of 35 feet per minute. The stadium, despite being relatively new, has already seen a fair amount of updates. In 2012, to ensure a Super Bowl host selection for Houston, the stadium's end zone screens were replaced with some of the largest displays at any stadium in the world at the time, with a total viewing area of 14,549 square feet. The stadium has successfully hosted two Super Bowls, with perhaps the most famous being Super Bowl 38, home of Janet Jackson's famous World Drive malfunction. Super Bowl 51 was also hosted at the stadium, and is famous for being the first Super Bowl to go into overtime. Poor Atlanta Falcons. Aside from football, the stadium was also purpose-built to host Houston's famous rodeo and livestock show. For three weeks every March, the stadium is host to bulls, broncos, steer, and other animals, as well as concession areas and a high-tech 42-foot concert stage where notable musicians perform during the three weeks of festivities. In addition to hosting the Texans in the rodeo, the stadium is also home to various college football games, with the Crown Jewel College Football National Championship game coming in 2024. International soccer games have also been hosted consistently at the stadium since its opening in 2003. NRG Stadium had massive shoes to fill as the replacement for the 8th wonder of the world, Astrodome. While the Astrodome will always have a special place in the hearts of Oilers and Astros fans, NRG does a good job of providing a more modern stadium experience, but still retaining a feeling of a classic indoor stadium. With that, the NRG Stadium joins the Archive of Everything. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and subscribe. Comment future video ideas, and heck your favorite color. As always, this is Matt from the Archive of Everything, and I'll see you all real soon.